Hey guys, and welcome back to Carrier. When we last left off, we made it back to the save room, and uh, the doctor's gone absolutely batshit mental. He seemingly passed out and then disappeared a little while later on. Uh, we met the Ark monster thing that looks like a giant bulbous, like, viney brain. We blew up the containment locker with the original seeds in it. Now we have to go and plant demolition charges as ordered by the Colonel. And then we will meet in engine room two and extract. So we had to go and place explosives on the uh, port side, I believe. Um, not exactly sure where that was. Uh, okay, okay, so where was the art room then? Um, uh, 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 so I mean the port would be the southern side. Okay, first computer room, magazine, reserve locker. Does it look down here? Alright, well, I mean, let's have a little look, shall we? We've got the save room there. So port is would be south on the map, I think. Oof. Didn't realise we were gonna be using nautical terminology here. Looks like we've got nothing going on. Uh right, where are we? Okay, so we want to go this away. Now, we need to find those big uh, great things, I believe. Now was it two or three of them? Oh. Something I can't remember how many of these things we've got to pop, but how many could there possibly be, right? Oh, hello! Get the fuck out of here, mutie scum! Oh shit! On a shovel! These mutant bastards are everywhere. Get the fuck off my ship, boy! That's the stuff. Get up! Get up! So I can kill you again. Nice. Oh man. Really enjoying this machine. Oh. Okay, I thought I could hear some more then, but that's. Uh, that is not more enemies. That is the empty shell cases rolling across the deck, which is a sound effect that pleases me greatly. Alright. Oh. Get out of here. Man. I like this machine gun. I see you, you sly little motherfucker. I can see you, but I can't quite hit you. This is a bit ass. No. Uh, dude? Dude? You alright there, buddy? Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. He's dead now, which is all that matters. Um, oh god, right, uh, we're gonna go through here, I think. I hope these are all more or less in the same place, otherwise we're probably gonna have some frustrating times ahead. Uh, okay. Ah! Right. There's one. Alright, that was... Painless enough, I suppose. Are they all going to be on this uh, corridor? That'd be nice. Alright, ready, Jack? Yeah, I mean, there's another one. Sweet! Okay. For some reason, I thought these were going to be quite difficult to actually find. Uh, I'm guessing we still can't go in through there. It's locked. Okay. Alright, well, fair enough. That's two down. Is it one or two to go? I can't remember. Anyway, apparently this is going to be enough to nuke the whole ship, so... Not sure if we're going to have, like, a time limit where we're going to have to, you know, get the fuck out of Dodge. So, hopefully the last one... Is... Yeah, there we go. Okay, so they were all in a line. Good. Happy with that. That's, That's the last, the last one. one. Now I just have to find the colonel. All right. It's set and ready to go off. Now, didn't, didn't he say, like, engine room... That one. Okay, so I should be able to go up and around. 
Right, I'm going to guess there's going to be more mutant bastards on the way that we're going to have to shred. Which is fine. We can handle that. It's quiet. Too quiet. Oh. Hey, friend. Uh, right, so we can't go through there. Oof. Ooh. Hello. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, you know, it would be wrong to leave you guys here. Considering how much fun the machine gun actually is to use. Oh, good. I was going to say, could actually even see my targeting reticle there. Go there, buddy. There you go. Does that feel better, dude? Yeah, that feels better. I got the cure for what ails you. You son of a bitch. You don't have the right to touch me. Fucking asshole. Yeah, that's it. You squirm on the floor. Uh... Why can't I target you? Oh, God. Oof. That's as close as it gets, ladies and gentlemen. All right, cool. Uh, let's jam a fresh magazine into our gun and keep going. Uh, yeah, so these mutant things are weird. They're really uh, not much of a threat. Oh, God. So, ah, uh, oh, really? Yeah, we got to go right round. Yeah, they're not much of like a threat at all. Um, pointless enemies comes to mind. Oh, hello. This is Transport 101. Is anyone out there? This is Spark Sergeant Ingalls. What is your situation? We are taking care of survivors on the flight deck. By order of Spark Team Leader Colonel Burke, we're going to sink the Heimdall by detonating explosives around the water drainage system on the lowest deck. What? The Heimdall? No. Why? What happened? Look, there's no time to explain the details, but we have no other choice. I see. Then we are waiting for you on the flight deck. Until then, we will get the rest of the survivors aboard. Roger. Yeah, uh, there's some serious, like, shit that went down here, dude. Uh, we'll fill you in a little bit later on. You know, when mutants aren't trying to chew my asshole out. Uh, do you want to go and then save it? Uh, no, it's right round the yeah right round here then we can go in drop a save because I uh, boss fight maybe I don't know I mean I guess we're almost at the end of the game which gee that uh, really snuck up on us didn't it at least it feels like the end I guess I shouldn't say too much just yet <laughs> hmm right I and we'll save over this one. I noticed we were playing this game in 2021. Damn, dude. Is that foreboding? Or is that just me being a fucking retard when I set the uh, console clock? Probably me just being retard. You know. Okay, so if we carry on around this corridor, we can link up the Sarge. Was it this one? Or Yeah, this one. And then take the immediate door, more or less. I'm guessing something bad's going to go wrong and shit's going to hit the fan and maybe one of us isn't going to be able to ex extract and we're going to go down with the ship. Also, uh, one of my friends, Jimmy, found that there was... Ooh. The bomb is set. Good. Here it goes. Oh, shit. Uh, surely we should have got out of here first. I'm just saying. You know. Ooh. Whoa. Well, I hope... I hope the water kills these things. It's actually quite a cool effect for the uh, Dreamcast, to be fair. Okay. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Alright. Yeah, you didn't have to ask me twice. Uh. Ooh. 
Colonel. The f Colonel Burke. Fuck is that? Well, that sounded pathetic. Doctor, go. Jack, let me handle this. Uh, I can't leave you. <laughs> I'll save you. Yeah. Flooding in engine room. Closing all partitions on deck six. What are you doing? Get out of here. Oh, shit. That's an order. Colonel! He's packing the explosives. The partitions are going to close. Hurry. Don't make my death meaningless. We're gonna try. Colonel! Colonel! <laughs> yes, Colonel! Colonel is dead, Jack. I mean, he's got like... I, I don't think there's any space left in his body for organs. He definitely should have been dead. I guess everyone's gonna die. What about Jennifer? I haven't seen her for a while. Colonel. <laughs> Colonel. 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 Colonel! Colonel. Colonel. Oh, look at those sad little puppy dog eyes. Look, Colonel's fragged, man. Let's go. No time to be shitting in your pants. Right, uh, why do you have the handgun out, dude? I mean, come on, man. We're a little bit past the handgun at this point. Um, yeah, I mean, I, well, everybody's dead. Everybody, right, how do we get out of here? Uh, oh, right, so we've got two choices. Must be no power. Uh, that's awkward. Right, that'll do. This is Transport 101. Spark Team, do you copy? This is Sergeant Engels. We've experienced a large shock. The detonation was successful? Yes, I'm on my way to the flight deck. You better hurry. We can't hang around here much longer. With the ship sinking, it soon will be possible to lift off. We will wait as long as we can. If you're not there, we're leaving without you. Roger. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Yeah, I I've said this before, but... I always get slightly hurt when, oh god, when, oh that water looks cool actually, uh, when you're always the last one surviving, it's just, it'd be nice if like a couple of team members made it out. Partition damage on deck six, deck six is flooded, all crew members must evacuate immediately. Uh oh, shit's really hit the fan, oh, okay. Maybe running would be a good idea. Oof. Whoa. Jesus. Fuck. Keep going, Jack. Ooh. Yeah, we fucked this place up. Uh, yeah. When in doubt, climb the green stuff. Sure. Oh god, I know where we are. Uh. It's where that big slug monster thing was. Well, that's if I don't awkward. do something soon. Yeah, like, you know, get out. You've already done the thing. Right, uh, okay. Ooh. Damn, it's still alive. Yeah. Oh shit on a shovel, run. Right. Oh god. Oh fuck me, he's fast. Oh my good god. He's he's pretty he's a pretty spry gentleman. Jesus, no time to fuck, fucking stop. Oh, shit. Yes, we need to... Right. 
Um, bollocks. What ones did we need to push? Right. Uh, we need to push the red ones, I think. Okay, cool. Right, let's go. Run. Uh, that's blue. That's blue. We don't want the blue. Oh, God. Wait. It was four. Ah, right. We need to push this son of a bitch. Number eight. Yes. Cool. There's one. Run. 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 Um, five. I don't know if we have to push these in a certain order. Actually can't remember. Is that all of them? You fucking bet your ass it ain't. I'm guessing we can't kill this guy. Oh god, seven. Seven! Stop tickling me. Um, yes. And then can we quickly go into our inventory? Because we are destination fucked right now. Uh, I'm not even going to fight this guy. Like, I'm guessing there's no point. Ouch. Please don't put your fingers in my bum, sir. We're open. We're good. Oof. Now, is he going to be chasing us, like, all the fucking way? Ah, oh, Jesus. Jack, are you okay? Captain, the colonel, a monster got him. What? The colonel? Damn. Well, there's nothing we can do but try to save ourselves. The transport plan is ready. Hurry to the flight deck. Yeah, yeah, yes, we know. Sir. We know. We're on the way. <sighs> Lieutenant, Fuck. can you hear me? Sergeant Ingalls, are you all right? Yes. The detonation was successful. I'm headed to the flight deck. Good. Colonel Burke is with you? No. Uh, I'm afraid the colonel didn't make it. What? The colonel too? I'm sorry. No, it's not your fault. And me, I wasn't able to do anything. Lieutenant. We don't have much time. Let's get out of here. The Olympus is nearby. I'll escape on that. You should come with. No, I'll head for the flight deck. Captain Lang is preparing a transport waiting for me. I see. Then be careful. With a little luck, I'll see you later at the base. Gotcha. But be careful, Lieutenant. Yeah, uh... Oh, God. Is there actually anything in there? Has it been restocked? Nope. Yeah, she doesn't know that we didn't kill the Colonel. We could have kicked his ass in front of the enemy. Oh, God. Look at all this. Damn. The Heimdall is damaged beyond repair. Abandon ship. Alright, we're trying to abandon ship, dude. We're trying. We're trying, trust me. Jesus. Jesus! Jesus, Crudler. Just, like stop staring at the door and oh hey friend hmm you're just gonna stand there all day or are you gonna get a little bit tasty <laughs> that face oh he's moving um, Damn, it's still alive I'm pretty sure we, they already used that line um shit Okay, oh god lord. Uh, oh, do we have to fight this saucy mofo right now? Um, yeah, possibly. Let's switch up to the R Buster. Let's see if we can actually, like, use this thing this time. Um, whoa, Jesus. Oh, okay. I mean, it did something, I guess. And we're injured. We're really injured. Uh, oh, we've got like seven of those. Cool. All right. I mean, sure. Um, right. Let's try and wait for him to attack. And then... Boom! Right in the face. Motherfucker. Ooh. He does not like this. Okay. So we... This always reloads, which is quite nice. Can you charge me? I don't know if we're actually doing much damage to him at all. Uh, question mark? Mate, make a move. Like, go on. It's your move, dude. It's your rodeo. 
Go in for a grab. Whatever you want to do, man. Just allow me to get in and give you a good old dose of reality. You know what, dude. Fine, whatever. Oh, you saucy. There we go. Is that it? Uh... I, uh, I, uh, I guess that's it. Well, that was anticlimactic. <laughs> okay. Guess he's still going. Jack. Oh. Art is not evil, and humans are not gods. Run, Jack. Go back. Take with you the warning of Art. Uh, While I am still human. Oh. <laughs> uh. Okay, so Ark is not evil. He just made a giant bulbous monster dude. Oof. Oh, Jesus. You're a juicy boy. Oh, God. Are we fighting this motherfucker again? I mean, sure, I guess. Right, let's chow down. Uh, yeah, let's drink down one of them. Oh, God. Right, this, this guy might be a little bit more tasty this time. Right, there's one. Oh, you can fire this thing pretty quick. Okay. Alright, you son of a fucking bitch. What do you think of that shit, huh? Huh? You want some more? Yeah, you want some more. We've got plenty to give you. Don't you worry about that. Dude, you've mutated. You are ugly. Oh, dude. Yeah, I think we're running out of grenades now. Really running out of grenades now. We've still got another one. Oof. Any more? Nope, we're dry. We're out of grenades. Um, shit. Uh, uh, hmm. Well, I mean, I guess that's all we really have, to be honest. Ow. Unless we just have to... Oh. Are we just... Waiting? Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess we didn't actually hit anything then. Which was good. We like these things. Man, this game's kind of feels glitchier than Cyberpunk, to be honest. Ooh, you just tickled me in the ass, mate. Let's just swig down a monster. Good to go. Now can we... Right, okay, well, I'm, we can't actually aim at this guy. So... I guess we've just got to run around him. I mean, eventually we are going to run out of... Um, <laughs> flaws, surely. Fuck you, buddy! Oh, God. Ouch. Oh, God, he does so much damage. So, Ark is not evil, it just wants to completely destroy all human life. And humans are evil, because humans, yo. I wouldn't say humans are inherently evil. Humans are inherently stupid. That's certainly fair to say, but I wouldn't say evil. Ah, no, I was going to say, we use some explosives, but actually, by the time we drop an explosive, I think it's going to be game over, man. Um, thanks, dude. Uh, oh, Yeah, okay, I guess we just had to keep running. With that guy hot on our ass cheeks. Oh, God. Oof. Oh, that thing's grizzly. I like it. Damn, Damn boy. Jack. Get back. Okay. 
Ah, it looks like the grenade launcher that we already put like 7,000 grenades into him. I guess this wipes the slate clean between us. It Captain. does. Hurry, get on! Out of all of those crew members, this is all that's left. Oh, shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I guess we weren't the only ones to survive. The captain did, at least. And so much for the Heimdall. Ah, oh, that's cool. It's over. A few hours, the Heimdall will be at the bottom of the sea. A few hours? Yeah, and we lost everybody. Our brother, our friends. Damn. I can see the coast. Have you heard? This area was closed off after a nuclear accident last year. Nothing living there. Places like this are showing up all over the world. At this rate, the Earth will be done soon. <laughs> we humans are destroying ourselves. Yep. All our hard work. Maybe it's best to start again from the beginning. Maybe what this is saying is not such a bad idea after all. Uh... Um, okay, is he just gonna like spread that shit everywhere? Kind of a bit of a twist at the end. He's going section 8 on us. Yeah, I mean, not everybody's destructive and bad. Just unfortunately the people that have the power. Which I guess is pretty bad. And that's Carrier. Oof. That was an interesting game. Um, I've got a feeling I would have definitely preferred it if I played it back way back in the day. Um, it wasn't a bad game. It was just bland, you know. And I think that's just because of the age of the game. Now, what's interesting is this game came, what, three years? Tops? Before the Resident Evil uh, 1 remaster, or remake, actually. Yeah, let that sink in. I mean, the Dreamcast definitely would have found it very difficult to compete with the GameCube and Xbox visually. It probably could have just about held in there with the PlayStation 2. They could have traded blows, but against the Xbox and the... Um, GameCube? Oof. But then, I mean, if you think about Japan as well, the Dreamcast actually came out like a good two years before uh, the PlayStation 2. In Japan, I believe, at least, anyway. Uh, and had a year head start everywhere else. So, I guess, really, by the time uh, 2002 rolled around and you had the Xbox out and the GameCube, uh, the Dreamcast technically would have been in its fourth year approximately so yeah they could have you know if it was successful they could have ridden it out i guess um it would have been nice to see you know what the machine could actually have done but as i was saying earlier before we were so rudely interrupted by cutscenes, uh jimmy of jimmy fails he actually discovered a video on youtube yes this was 2000 so yeah, two years, I guess. <laughs> wow, two years before... Holy shit, you know, 1995 to 2005, that 10-year that period, what a rapid increase in visuals we had. Jesus Christ. 
you went from um basic third um yeah basic 3d visuals back in 1995 for the saturn and the playstation and the n64 all the way up to to 2005 where we had the hd um xbox 360 came out what a decade for progress fuck i mean i'm talking transformative progress yeah that was mad mental um yeah so uh, jimmy found a video on youtube actually uh that shows there was going to be a carrier 2 for the original xbox i mean i guess obviously that never came to pass but that was quite interesting so i would have liked a sequel to this game it would have been interesting to see where where things could have gone i suppose now um but wait there's more because we're not strictly done with this game just yet i believe yeah. if we go to load and we load um jack's save we have a boosty bonus we have another mode to play a story driven mode apparently so if we load this, let's see what happens. I mean, I guess for diehards of the genre, I would say this is worth playing, but it hasn't held up like Resident Evil or Silent Hill has, in my opinion. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oof. Where There's am a I? Face. Who are you? Are you okay? I'm Lieutenant Ingalls. You're on deck two in the service elevator. I found you when I was looking for survivors. I carried you here. Ingalls? You must be Sergeant Ingalls' brother. Sergeant Ingalls? Jack Ingalls? You know Jack? It's a small world. Mm -hmm. I'm Lieutenant Manning of the Information Division, Section 1. I'm part of the team sent by NTA to investigate the accident. And your brother is part of the same team. He's here somewhere. Really? Any idea where he is right now? Well, the helicopter we came in on was shot down by the ship's defense system. We were separated when we bailed out. Mm -hmm. I see. If I made it, Jack certainly would have too. Wait, Didn't just a minute. Word. I'll try to call him. Sergeant idea. Ingalls, can you hear me? This is Lieutenant Manning. Lieutenant Manning, you okay? Yeah, I just came too. But more importantly, your brother is here. He saved me. Lieutenant, what happened? I can hardly hear you. There's too much static. I can't hear you. Can you hear me? Your brother is alive. <laughs> He's gone. Is he okay? There was a lot of static and I couldn't hear very well. But he sounded fine. Good. Lieutenant Ingalls, what is going on here? Well, it all started with the bomb set by the Southern Cross. Radioactivity from the bomb caused Ark to germinate. After that, the whole boat changed into this hell. What do you mean? What is Ark? Uh, we still don't really know. I'm trying to collect information and rescue any survivors. I see. Look, Lieutenant, I don't know if it's my place to say, but the ship has become too dangerous. I think you should evacuate. Thank you for your concern, but I have a job to do. The other members of my team should be somewhere in the ship. I must confirm their safety. I'm as concerned about my friends as you are. Of course. Then I'll get back to rescuing the crew. Lieutenant Ingalls, be careful. I hope that you find your brother in good health. Thanks. You be careful out there, too. Yeah, I hope you don't get infected and have to shoot yourself in the face. That'd be terrible. Truly terrible, you know? truly a tale of woe so second part of the game yes we have the gadget one hmm we are now playing as jennifer this is a really bizarre name 
Um, 9mm automatic pistol with a 13 round magazine manufactured by Everest. Uh, good, I guess. We've got a handful of bullets and we have two level 1 energy drinks. We also, as luck would have it, have the visor. But that's all we have time for here today, guys. So when we return, I guess we're going to go explore the ship again as Jennifer. Uh, this would have been a pretty interesting little bonus. Um, unlocking and finding this out uh, back in the day. So, interesting stuff indeed. Anyway, thanks for watching guys and as always, until next time.